so you haven't gotten your race before yet. And that is whether because you just started your trials, you keep getting killed by teamers, or you just always lose. Well, let me show you guys how to always win every trial. So I think after getting uh, V4 on multiple races, I finally found the best setup. So what you want to bring is Dragon Talon, Buddha Fruit, any sword that you like. I prefer Chris Katana and Soul Guitar. Also, you would want to bring Gold Mask. So if you are any other race that is not Shark or Angel, this is the build that you want to have for every single trial. Even though Dragon Talon doesn't have the fastest M1s, but check this out, alright? You see how big this room is? Look at this AoE on Dragon Talon. As a Buddha, you can just trap someone in the corner and you'll get a lot of AoE damage off. Even against teamers. And since you have Gold Mask, you'll get some Lifesteal. Plus your Soul Guitar, you also get some Lifesteal. And also Dragon Talon, the uh, X spoof, you uh, use it on the ground. You leave a little fire puddle on the ground, which also breaks Ken. Okay, so let's say you are Shark or Angel. For your first trial, you'll want to use this setup as well. But once you are able to choose your first gear, if you are a Shark, go with Leviathan Armor. If you are Angel, choose King's Rule first. Once you have those, on your next trial, you can now go with Lei and then bring Chris Katana or any sword you're liking. Again, I recommend Chris Katana. With those two races that have so much sustain, you'll just constantly gain your shield as a shark and you'll just constantly heal as an angel. Plus your king's rule, you will always break their kin. So yes, in terms of fighting style, I think Dragon Talon is probably the best. Next after Dragon Talon would be Electric Claw since you have your C move to break kin and it's not too hard to hit. And the M1s are super fast. After that, you can probably go Sharkman Karate since the fighting style has the fastest M1s and it has quite a bit of AoE. With your swords, you can go with multiple swords, but there is only a select few that I like. The best one is probably Chris Katana because you have the AoE and your uh, M1s are super fast. Especially if you have it upgraded, this sword, this sword is really good. Next is True Triple Katana. The only thing I really like about this sword is that it does the most uh, M1 damage. But it's not too fast. It's decent. And I don't think your X move can break in. And then you also have Hollow Scythe. This weapon is really good. Um, it has the fastest in ones. But then the AoE, like, it's not too good. You have that move. You have the Dev Cyclone. But then your slow execution is probably not the best. But yeah, you have a lot of uh, attack speed. And the last sword, in my opinion, that is really good. Which I think is really underrated. Is Toshida. Your M1s are not too slow, your damage is pretty decent, but then here's the buying point for me, your Z move. Like that move is super OP. And then you also get this move too, which is a free dash. This sword is super underrated for trials, and it's understandable because Curse Katana is just better. For your guns, regardless of what you use, you would just want to bring a uh, Soul Guitar, like it's the best. <laughs> like just check this out, I mean I'm pretty sure you guys already seen it. Look how huge that is. It's like impossible to miss. And you also have a knockback. Okay, so now for your fruits, there are several picks. But what you are looking forward to are just fruits that have really big AoE. So like dragon, dragon is really good. Control, you could probably make control work out with the control room, but then you might just need to be careful because there is a move, but I forgot which one it is that will teleport you under the map. Venom is also really good. It's just kind of like Dragon, where you can transform into a really big uh, animal and put out insane AoE. Um, Doe is pretty good. I see people use this for a lot. This is really good because of your uh, big old AoE. Rumble, um, I see people make it work. Again, you have a lot of AoE. One thing about Rumble is that because of these uh, big old structures, it's possible for your V move to get stuck on one of these and then you won't hit the ground. And then you have Buddha, which is the best fruit that I think you should use. Um, Magma, I don't see Magma people at all, but I think you can make it work. And then Flame as well, I think you can make Flame work. But yes, Buddha is probably the best uh, fruit for Trials. Like, even against Dragon players, like if they become a Dragon, you can just jump on top of them and then just auto attack them from up there. Only downside to Buddha is that once people see that you have a Buddha fruit, they will likely just gang up on you. But then regardless, most trials, like, people are usually teaming, so it doesn't really matter anyways. Unless you have your own uh, partner with you. But don't use Buddha just to uh, click, to auto-click. Don't forget, Buddha has a lot of AoE as well, alright? Your C move is AoE, and your V move. 
Look at that. So yeah, use this fruit to its absolute limits. So yeah, again, uh, if you are not Shark or Angel, go with this setup. Dragon Talon, Buddha, Go Mask, uh, any story you're liking, and the Soul Guitar. For every single trial, even if you are able to get like your second gear ready, like just keep running with this one. For Shark and Angel, once you get your first gear, again like I said, if you're a Shark, choose Leviathan Armor first. If you're an Angel, choose King's Rule first. Of course, get Buddha, use Lei, and then Curse Katana. With these builds, you should be able to win every single trial. Unless you choke heavy or you get two Buddhas that are teaming on you. And that'll be it for the video. Like and subscribe. Update 20 is right around the corner. So be on the lookout. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace out, Charles.